With Russian energy imports banned, many are asking, where else can we get our oil and gas? New Mexico is the second biggest producer of oil in the country, so some people want the feds to loosen regulatory policies so our state can increase production. Stella Sun joins us live with their response. Yeah, the statewide average for a gallon of gas shot up 14 cents here in New Mexico overnight. And now the statewide average here is $4.04. But you can see at this gas station here at Comanche, it's $4.09. People I spoke with say loosening oil and gas production rules in the U.S. could help us rely less on other countries for energy. It's pain at the gas pump. And this is an incredible uh, increase that will affect everyone. That's Riley White. He teaches finance at the University of New Mexico. For instance, if you drive 15,000 miles a year, every dollar increase uh, uh, to the price of gas means you're paying an extra 620 bucks a year. Uh, on your bottom line, and that's a huge sum uh, for many working families. He says when people are paying more at the pump, that's less money they'll spend on dining, shopping, and travel. And now that Russian energy is out of the equation, some want the U.S. to take advantage of this moment and bump up our production. As people shun Russian oil and natural gas, they're looking for other options. Increasingly, they're looking to the United States and they're looking to the state that has grown the most over the past five years, and that's right here in New Mexico. Robert McIntyre with the New Mexico Oil and Gas Association says federal regulatory policies is straining New Mexico's ability to grow its oil and gas industry. We should be producing, we should be drilling, we should be exporting both oil and liquid natural gas, not only to the American people, but to our allies. Congresswoman Yvette Harrell says she's pushing the feds to lift its ban on new oil and gas leases on federal land. The governor was critical on the ban last year and sent us this statement, quote, New Mexico's oil and gas industry is currently producing at record levels, and that growth is continuing in a responsible way under our nation leading methane rules. Now you might be looking at these gas prices and thinking, why is it so expensive when New Mexico produces so much oil? Well, according to the New Mexico Oil and Gas Association, we don't consume everything we produce. A lot of what we produce here in New Mexico gets shipped overseas or across our borders. And they say by loosening some of these oil and gas production rules, they could be able to produce more oil. Reporting live in Northeast Albuquerque, I'm Saul Sun, KOT Action 7 News. And the governor's office is now calling on Congress to temporarily suspend the federal gas tax, a move that could cut gas prices by 18 cents a gallon.